Also on 7, a man caught on camera making light of a dangerous device at a South Florida bar. An employee left on edge after noticing it was a grenade. 7's Franklin White tells us how teamwork led to a tavern takedown. The bartender handed me a note that said, the guy behind me has a grenade. This man says he was there when a dangerous discovery led to a customer tackled outside a Wilton Manor's bar. I grabbed my stuff and I left. It was Tuesday night when surveillance video shows a customer at Corner Pub off North Andrews Avenue as he casually pulls the grenade from his pocket and places it on the counter. And then um, said, don't be scared. And I was like, oh no, I'm not scared. But even though I was petrified. Joe Shakespeare was behind the bar that night and did his best to remain calm, letting his bosses know who called the police. Their advice was to have the customers leave the building. We started working together and getting people out of the bar slowly. That's when this customer named Daryl stepped in and took on the role of distracting the man and kept him talking while everyone else safely got out. He was agitated at somebody in the bar for some reason and uh, anything I could do to distract that mindset. Once they were out, Daryl then points the man to the door and once outside, he takes him down. First thing I did was grab his left hand, get that away from the grenade. Um, then I did a leg sweep, push him down with the full body weight. Police officers waiting outside would take it from there. The gravity of what could have happened hitting Joe hours later. Yeah. Like when I got home, I was like, God, that could have been really bad. Franklin White, Today in Florida. Well, the grenade turned out not to be live and could not have detonated. Officers are now helping the man seek mental health treatment.